Over the years, I've heard many men tell me that they felt God was far away. They told me they were searching for something greater and looking for fulfillment, for happiness, for more greater satisfaction. To no surprise, many of them told me that attendance at a different retreat or at a men's conference changed everything. And that's why we're here today, right? If we can change one man today, change their heart, it was worth doing all this today. When we search for fulfillment, which leads to Christ, joy awaits us. Life and lives are changed. God leads men and comforts them. And with that comes an outpouring of grace. I recently attended a That Man Is You session at Good Shepherd. By the way, if you're interested in that, it's Tuesday morning. To 5.30, if you're interested. I don't have time for all the announcements, but um, that man is you. Basically, they said, waste time with your family. I said, wow, what a, what a concept. That, that means being with your family. That means uh, praying with your family. That's just being around your family instead of on that smartphone or the tablet or the computer. How many times do we come home and we're on our cell phone from work and we're just not paying attention to our family. God wants us to be there with our family and waste time with them. We can also waste time with God. That's why you're here today, wasting time with God. It's really not wasting time, but, but that was the concept that to be with God and adoration and men's conferences and men's groups, uh, that man is you, whatever it is, spend time with God. St. Teresa of Avila said prayer is nothing more than being in, in terms of friendship with God. Catholic Brothers is helping to fuel the movement in, a, in North Texas. We've had eight conferences in the spring. We've had three fall conferences. We've had a couple movie events. We sponsored a Christmas musical experience, the King of the Nations, all that. You guys are supporting that greatly. So get to today, just enjoy fellowship with your table, with your the men here. Again, thank you for being here. And uh, just one note, if, if, if you have time today and you want to send us a prayer, there's a basket here, there's index cards on your table. And just put the prayer and we pray for you guys every day. Um, to do, so feel free to do that. All right, so let's get on with it. Let's, the food is being served, so let's... Bless the food, um, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Thank you, Lord, for this food which we set before us. May we use it to nourish our bodies, and, and thee to nourish our souls. Make us ever mindful of the needs of others. Bless, bless us, O Lord, and these I gifts, which we are about to receive from thy bounty through Christ our Lord, amen. In the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, amen. Let's have breakfast. Thank you, guys.